Am I even like relevant enough to do a video like this? Like, every YouTuber right now is sort of doing it, so you know, I automatically have to jump into that bandwagon because uh, it's it's YouTube, honey. You gotta jump into the bandwagon sometimes. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to my channel. Is this angle more aesthetically pleasing for you my room isn't completely done decoration wise but i want to try so i don't know if this video is gonna go well or if i only got like two or three responses on my story but i'm going to be reading your assumptions about me recording on my phone you already know the deal i screenshotted the assumptions and i airdropped them to my computer so i will be reading them from there first one is that you're struggling you know in all seriousness uh i feel like everybody struggles personally i don't have anything big that i'm struggling with right now but i've struggled with work i've struggled with school i've struggled with friendships relationships a bunch of shit but nothing big like that at the moment next one is that i want to move out i feel like right now i don't really want to move out i feel like i don't have the money for that not even with roommates i have the money for that so i feel like i just want to get financially stable you know even though it'll, it's kind of hard being in college and everything i'd rather just save up money when i'm actually ready to move out than just move out right now and struggle for like the whole year paying rent or taxes or whatever next one is you've never had a serious relationship i feel like this one is probably like something that people may think of me just because you don't see me posting stuff on my stories or my Instagram of me having a boyfriend or anything So I can see where you guys were like sort of get that but I've had a serious relationship Yes, okay I put a lot of energy and a lot of time and I was completely happy with that I cared a lot about that person It was just like when you're in a serious relationship you guys that are in one or have been in one You guys know the feeling like you guys are head over heels you would do anything for them even after you guys finish off you still care you still want to follow up you just want to make sure everything is still okay so yeah i have been in one and i still care about the person a lot you know we keep in touch here and there but i'm not in one right now i don't see myself being in one like that for a while just because i want to focus on myself this year i have a lot of goals a lot of things that i want to do so you won't see me in one for a while but i have been in one before Next is your sensitive. I'm very sensitive, not in the fact where you can't joke around with me, because I can take a lot of jokes until you like cross the line, then it's like, okay, why would you say something like that? I am sensitive in the fact that I cry, like, you know, I have a heart. I'm not like evil or anything. I'm a Scorpio and we have that reputation that like we're evil. I'm kind of the opposite of that. <laughs> I will make your life better. <laughs> Next one is, you're probably too pretty for me. And that is when you're wrong. I don't think I'm too pretty for anybody. If I like you, I like you. I've liked all different types. So it's like, I don't really see myself as too pretty for anybody. I don't really think any girl is too pretty for someone because it all depends really on how the person is. Like if you treat a girl how they're supposed to be treated, you know, it's just, I'm not too pretty for you, okay? I'm not no <laughs> next one is a lot of friends and i do have a lot of friends i do but when it comes to close friends i only have a few i do keep some things to myself but my close friends and my best friend you know they know a lot about me they know who i am i share a lot with them i open up to them about things and they do the same with me so it's only like four or five of those people that actually get to see that side of me basically next one is you get annoyed very easily i don't get annoyed very easily actually i'm pretty patient i have put up with a lot of stuff in the end i feel like time passes on you know it happened you can't just keep that negativity in your head in your mind and your life in general because of something that happened years ago or m even months ago you know you just have to move on if they apologize for it if they like recognize that they did wrong then it's like okay you know you recognized it you apologize i could get annoyed but you just have to cross that line for me to get there because i'm very understanding which is like it's good <laughs> but it could you know slap me back in the face it's just it's just how i am 
Next one is, you're single, more of a hope. I think I responded to this one with other assumptions, but yes, I'm single, but I'm not looking for anything like I said. I wanna focus on myself this year. I have a lot of things I wanna do, a lot of plans that I have for myself. So that's basically it for that one. Uh, this one's in Spanish. It says, eres una persona muy dulce y buena, y eres muy simpática y divertida. Te adoro muchísimo. Sweet, I, I am sweet. I don't wanna like, I don't wanna, some, some of these things, they're compliments, so it's like, I don't wanna sound conceited if I agree with them. I am very sweet, I think. I personally think that I am very sweet. <laughs> I do think that I was raised with good people around me and you know, my family has a lot of influence on that because I'm very family oriented and my whole family is like super good hearted, kind hearted and I get a lot of it from them. So I do think I'm a good person. I do have a good heart. Um, very sympathetic. I cleared that up in another assumption. So yes, I can be very sympathetic and fun. I am fun. <laughs> I can have fun in any situation, to be honest. I can be in a car with you for hours and it will be like the time of my life. I feel like it just depends on the person that you're with. The simplest things, it's like, I can make it fun, you know? I can, I don't know, I can just make it crazy. I can make it like an adventure. Next! Oh my God, the light just like made me 12 shades lighter. Next one is you go out a lot. Uh, I basically cleared that up again. I don't go out a lot, to be honest. You know, if there's time to, then I will, but it doesn't happen like a lot. <laughs> Last one is you're creative as beep. <laughs> I am creative as hell. Um, I have moments where it's like you get the artist block and stuff like that, but I feel like everybody gets those, to be honest. I am very creative when I'm in, you know, my, my zone. I've been creating sketches for movie posters that haven't come out yet. I've drawn, like I randomly got this like scrap of paper that I messed up on for a project and I drew a lion. I made, I did this bro, from paper that I was gonna throw away and I was like, I don't wanna waste it. Let me just, let me just do something with it. And I did put on my story if you guys wanted me to sort of life draw or try to life draw anything else. And I have been working on them. I'm doing the shark one right now. And you guys will see them on my story, on my art page that I will link down below or I'll put just in the bottom here because I've been wanting to sort of put my links in the videos just in case you guys don't know it's in the description, you know, just, just a little help, you know. Yeah, those are basically all the ones I got. I got, to be honest, a lot more than I thought I was going to get. Oh my God, I forgot one. Hold on, hold on. Uh, this is another compliment. It just says that uh, you're beautiful, smart, funny, and talented. You seem like an amazing person to be around. Thank you for the compliments. I'm smart in subjects that I enjoy doing. <laughs> funny, I already cleared that up. I can be pretty funny, you know, it depends on, depends on if you have a sense of humor or not. A talented, thank you so much um, that you actually think that I'm, you know, I'm talented enough to call me talented. I'm not at the level of skill that I want to be at yet, but I really appreciate the compliment though. It means a lot to me. I feel like you could tell from the other assumptions what kind of person I am. But yeah, I mean, thank you. That means a lot. Like I didn't really expect to have like these compliments and everything. So it means a lot from you guys. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe to this channel if you like my content. Thank you for a thousand subscribers. I don't know if I mentioned it in my last video, but if I didn't, thank you so much. It means the world. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you guys next week with a video. Like, I never plan these things because I just have so much going on. I just like turn on the camera and <laughs> I just start. I got bangs, by the way. It's in my eye. Do you like them? Do you like my bangs? Do you like them? Sorry, my hair is like a mess right now. It's like curly and natural, whatever. Blech. Do you like them?